Hey, I'm Chris, and today we're going to review this gimbal that Hohem kindly sent to me for review. This is the iSteady Mobile Plus. Straight out of the gate, the build quality is fairly decent. It comes with this great protective case, which is similar to what you get with a full-size gimbal. It also has a mini tripod and a USB charging cable. Considering the size of this and how heavy footed I was, I was very impressed with how smooth the shots that came out of this were. Take a look at this example shot with the wide lens. I start off walking and then progress into running to keep up with Robbie on his BMX. The gimbal counted all of the shakes and vibrations perfectly and made it look super smooth. And what about using the telephoto lens? Well, I can safely say I was able to get some smooth shots and even mimicked a dolly style. And I understand Apple does an amazing job with their own built-in stabilization, but this just makes it 10 times better and so much smoother. Now, if I'm honest, this actually performs better than my full-size gimbal. I simply put the phone in, turn it on, and it's ready to go. Unlike with my full-size gimbal where you have to balance it, I don't have to worry about that at all. Now that I'm comparing it to a full-size gimbal, let's compare some features. This trigger, like on my full-size one, double taps it, resets the gimbal, or if I hold it, it locks it in place. There are four modes accessible from tapping this button. Now, there is an app that's designed specifically for this gimbal. I didn't use it, but it packs a lot of features. The app lets you adjust all the parameters of the gimbal, allow zooming and focusing using this switch here, face tracking, and even time lapse. And finally, this little joystick here to control manual movements of the gimbal. The phone clamp adjusts to fit most modern smartphones. With the iPhone 11 Pro Max, I'm pushing the limits and I've had to extend the arm fully to cater to this. And you can adjust the clamp to shoot in portrait mode if you're into that thing. Charging is simple. With a supplied micro USB cable, I was able to get around five hours of use with over 50% battery remaining. There's also this USB port here, which you can charge your phone in. So essentially the gimbal doubles up as a battery bank. Now I can't review this product without pointing out any of the downsides which I came across. And honestly, there were only a few. The biggest issue I have is my ultra wide lens just doesn't work. This motor right here gets in the way, it creeps into shot and therefore it's unusable. After about two hours of use, the motors did have a few issues with vibrating and going a bit off axis. This was simply fixed by turning it on and off again. And finally, sometimes I found that switching between modes didn't recognize my button pushes, so I'd have to go through and try again. But despite those issues, I was absolutely blown away by the performance of this gimbal. I can't get shots like that on my full size gimbal without using a stabilizer. So I can honestly recommend this if you can get over the few issues that it has. So thank you Hohem for sending me this gimbal. It's something I'm definitely going to keep in my bag. And thank you for watching. If you'd like to pick one up, there's links in the description below. And if you wouldn't mind subscribing or hitting that like button, be very much appreciated. And I'll see you in the next one.